Alright guys, got a little gift in the mail today. DC Comics deck building game. Looking forward to checking this baby out. Big superhero fan growing up. Big comic fan, so let's see what we can do here. Well, let's get this open. We got our little manual here, which most of us never like to check out until after we screw the game up enough times. But let's just open it up and see what it's about. Got some, oh, Raz Al Ghul there. These pictures bring back good memories. Superman, different villains. We got Cyborg there, the Joker. This game looks like it's gonna be interesting. There's the Riddler right there. First, we'll check out the superhero pack right here. Get these cards out. Okay, so. From what I understand so far, we're going to start with a superhero. So we got Superman, we got Batman, Green Lantern, Aquaman, I don't know how super he is, The Flash, Cyborg, and Wonder Woman. You know, so if I'm picking, I'd have to go with the top three guys. You know, Superman is my original favorite guy. Um, grew up with a lot of Superman stuff, you know, Kal-El's the man. But Batman has become one of my all-time favorites as well. Um, Green Lantern, I liked him in Justice League, but I'd still have to go with these two. He'd be a, a third choice for me if my son and his buddies got first pick on this game. Okay, so let's go to the next deck of cards here. Well, I'd have to go to the manual to figure out what these are, but we got starter cards, punch cards... And this is exactly why I would be going right to the manual to find out what that is. Let's put these back here. Basically, we got Superman and Batman on the cards. It's the best thing I see about those right now. And now we got a big deck of cards coming out here. These are going to be the skills that we can establish. And let's try and bring them up like this. There we go. So what do we got with these babies? Okay, we got Bizarro, one of Superman's arch nemesis. So this gives you a plus three in the game for power. Cheetah. Doomsday, one of Superman's all-time greatest villains. There we go. Gorilla Groot. Harley Quinn, Batman. Poison Ivy, Scarecrow, we got a bunch of Batman villains coming all in at once. Solomon Grundy, a straight weakness card, reduce your score at the end of the game. Well, we're going to have to avoid those cards, or when I was a kid I'd just give them back because I don't like to lose. Not that I would cheat on purpose, but when mom and dad are playing with you, you do what you want. Green Arrow. Here's some power ones, so Wonder Woman, you grab one of her cards, you get a plus one for power. That's because she's a woman. I don't mean that, but you'd get a plus three if it was Superman. He's a guy. What else we got in here? We got the power ring, so we're looking at a Green Lantern card here. Look at that. See what I mean? Plus three for power. See, that makes sense now. That makes sense. What do we got here for the Batmobile? If this is the first card you play this turn, discard your hand and draw five cards. Otherwise, plus one power. I assume that's a real good thing. Plus one power for just putting out the bat signal. Look at these guys. Over to the Green Arrow, plus two for power. Kid Flash lets you draw a card. So again, these are all action cards as you're playing the game, so makes a lot of sense. Hero card, Swamp Thing, the Emerald Knight, Zatanna. These bring back a lot of good memories, you know, like the Batman series, all these DC series, this is great. Superpower plus two for Superman here. For me, he should be like plus ten. Oh, here's a superpower plus three for him. I guess they got to make the game fair, and we can't all play favorites. Batman with his karate kick. A little more agile than me. I don't kick that high. Superpower plus five. See, that's what I've been talking about this whole time. When you pull a Superman card. You need something big. That's a plus five. 
I'm going to have somebody who's already seen this game commenting on my bad skills here, but let's be honest here. I'm going to cheat until I know how I'm playing the game. There's a villain for you. You know, I think the next uh, superhero movie is going to have him in it. He's a bad boy, Darkseed. Oh, my all-time favorite villain, Lex Luthor, because he's bald like me. And he's a genius, not like me. I get punched in the face for a living. Not so smart. Raza Ghoul. This game looks like a lot of fun, guys. Show me the Joker. Just tell me about the game. All right, so pretty much what we got to do here, like I said, is we take a superhero card, we pick who we want to be. So two to five players. For today, because I don't want to be cheating, I'll pull the Batman card because I guess Superman should always win. So I pull the Batman card. Everybody would select their superhero. Would go through, I think, with the get basic skills. So we get a couple basic skills. We earn one skill at a time. And then as we go through the game, these are our action cards. So you pull a card at your turn. You pull a card to see what you get. And you're either going to go up in strength, down in strength, to see how you go. And at the end of the game, we're going to try and defeat as many villains as we can. Whoever defeats the most villains wins. And then I guess I get to steal your card the wrong way. That's how this game works for me today. Thanks, guys.